I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at one of the biggest and baddest super seas on the planet today. This is a 2022 Dynamax DX3 model 34KD with the optional blacked out package. We are going to take a look at the outside features first and the inside features. Then, we're going to give you three things we love about the Dynamax and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video again today. I am super excited that we are taking a look at the Dynamax DX3 with the Detroit Diesel Andrea. You know I love Super C's and this one is super duper. Before I begin, gotta say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea! Hi everyone! How's it going today? It's going good, you guys. We are here in Texas. We are always excited to come here for the inventory. And Andrea, today the film date is August 28th. What are we doing tomorrow? We are flying to Europe! Yes! Guys, we are going to Dusseldorf, Germany for the world's biggest RV show. Yes, guys, and we're starting a new series. It's called Matt's RV Reviews Europe Edition and we will be debuting the videos every Saturday or Sunday live premiere. So make sure you guys join us this weekend coming up for the first edition of Matt's RV Reviews Europe Edition. It'll be so much fun, right? Hopefully. I hope so. Andrea, let's begin. Model is Dynamax DX3. The actual tip to tip length is 39 feet, two inches. This the Dynamax. It sits on the Freightliner chassis. Check it out. Give me a second. So first, this has the blackout package. Look how nice this looks. It's the Freightliner chassis. Detroit diesel at 375 horsepower, 1,050 pound-feet of torque. Andrea, is that not an awesome engine? I'm telling you. Mm. Look at the horn. The air horn here. Oh, yeah. We'll be listening to that air horn in a minute. Look at these tires, Andrea. They're the Michelin's. 275-80R, 22.5 with the American Racing ATX Blacked Out Series. Nice. Andre, this is a monster motorhome, I love it. Right here's the windows, look at this. I wow. said windows, I meant mirrors. Look at this, Andre, you literally have to climb up in here. Look at these seats, look at these seats. Wow. We are trucking, hell yeah, little bit. I just can't wait, I just can't wait, come here. No, you don't need to climb up, but I'm sitting here driving. We're hitting the bumps. We're going like this, and we're going. Woo! That is America. This is a Dynamax DX3. And then when you're all, look at this, Andre. I literally have to jump out. You don't see Super C's with like the double steps up like that. Fuel there Phillips right there on the other side as well. Yes, ma'am. And then right here is the side cameras. Left side, right side in reverse. And then look at this full body paint wow, job, Andrea. Wow, beautiful. It's a Dean Lauch's full body paint job. He's the, he does the master print of this. It's very nice. Frameless windows. And then you do have the armless awnings right there. Right here on the outside. Nice TV and sound system. And then here we have very nice storage. more storage very nice aluminum slam latch doors more storage yes man wow. look at that rim right there it's the blacked out series looks absolutely fantastic andrea i'm losing my energy right here we do have the aqua hot 400d very nice water heater everybody yes ma'am more storage there and then look at that dean logs paint job He's a good friend of our friend Andrew Steele. 
and it's funny because um i was at the nascar race and i was talking to my my new friend kyle bush we were talking about rvs and uh he has a liberty coach that was painted by dean louts but what's even more impressive andrea i was talking to kyle it's like dude did you get your uh golf cart painted by dean louts as well to match his motorhome he's like i sure did wow and then look at his hitch andrea you can tow twenty thousand pounds wow. behind this motorhome and again 375 horsepower a thousand fifty pound feet of torque very nice nice rear design rear cap good led lights your backup camera there and andre no ladder to get up on the roof unfortunately and then coming on down here we do have storage there which is very nice thank you ma'am look at this this is a wet bay you got your uh macerator right here outdoor shower water pumps really really nice retractable fresh water hose filter potable water fill potable potable yes ma'am and then coming on down oh wow. in 8000 generator diesel generator right here 50 amp power cord with a reel very nice batteries lithium batteries right there and then storage right there 3000 watt inverter and everything oh, that's pretty good right this whole thing's good the outside of this motorhome looks great but the inside looks even better let's go take a look first it's where you fill up your def and this is how you climb into this baby i'm trying to go around i'm coming in this way all right all right so the cargo carrying capacity is 3,217 pounds. Only in America, Andrea. Wait. That's right. Yeah, it is. Okay. Slide is in. As you can see, oh, look at this walkway. Wow. Spacious. Definitely open the fridge. Walk through here. We got a split bathroom. Can definitely use the bed with the slide in. Wow. And Andrea. Uh, we can't wait for everybody to join us this weekend at the Matt's RV RV's Europe edition on YouTube. But while we're getting the slide outs out, we do want to let everybody know that the Hershey show is just a couple weeks away and RV life is going to be there. And they're putting on a seminar every day about how to use RV life. So if you guys haven't already downloaded the app, download the app, use promo code Matt's RV reviews. You get a free seven day trial and 25% off if you do decide to keep it and make sure you stop by the RV life display at the Hershey show and make sure you tell them you love Matt's RV reviews because without them, we're not able to do all this for the show. All right, Andrea, I know I'm doing it twice, but let's get in this driver's seat again. This is wow. the great liner with the Detroit diesel, Andrea. Listen to this baby roar. Wow. Heck yeah, this is a beast of a motorhome. Right here is where you can adjust your mirrors. You got all your dash right there. Everything, your transmission, your shades. Right here, that's where the air horn is. Right here, this is where you control your windows. It's your parking brake. You got your camera system and everything. TST, tire pressure monitoring system. Oh boy, litigation. Yes ma'am, sit in that cockpit seat. Yes. Cup holders here, air conditioning control. How does that feel? Woohoo! Let's go Matt. Let's go let's trucking. Let's go. Let's just go. Let's hop in. This is nice. Yes, ma'am. Plenty of leg space in here. Wow. And uh, it's very, very fantastic. Ooh. Not only that, I got Gen Start, Master Light Switch, and everything. Okay, that's pretty cool. Yes, ma'am. And then above this, Andrea, is a bunk over the cab. All right. We got a bunk over the cab here. I do see a ladder that goes right there. Got posing windows on both sides with MCD privacy shades. Yes, ma'am. I don't know the weight. It's most likely 500 pounds. Yeah, looks river. pretty good. And yeah. look back there, it looks like their electrical outlet USB. And then you got this safety bar for the uh, bunk over the cab. And then uh, coming down here into the living room area. I think you should take a look at that right here. Yeah, so you got a little bit of storage there, not much. Uh, here's your controls, your digital screen and everything. We got the uh, AC blasting right here. A little closet. Yes, ma'am more storage oh there's the sound bar and a sound bar right there yes 
And then Andrea, the TV's right here. There is storage behind it. You'll show that once we look in the kitchen, but it is directly across from look, the Thomas Paine wow. theater seats. And that is the one that massages and does the heat, right? Oh yeah. Oh, we need one of oh, those. Oh, hang on, here we go. Here we go, electric Andrea Thomas Paine. You got the third seat right here. Oh. Does not fall down and make a thing. Um, but this is very nice. This seat will also recline so you can have a three seat of recliner seat. You have the table here. I'm not a huge fan I'm of these tables, either. Andrea. I really I think, think they, they kind of look cheap. tacky. They do. Yeah. But um, double cup holders. But again, truthfully, practicality wise, I mean, they might work good. You know what I'm saying? Um, but, you know, still, aesthetically, they don't look good. Right here, we do have daytime shades and privacy shades. And then check out these valances. Approved! Bing! Oh, Andrea loves those valances. I'm telling you. They are super cute. I mean, look at them. I love the uh, two-tone color, yeah. the shapes and the contrast. Very cute. Right here, we got USB right underneath there. And we've got this nice storage above the sofa. Very nice. Very, very cute. Good cabinetry and everything. And then over here, we do have seats. Traditional dinette. Oh, see, that's great. Look at that. Very wow. nice. Nice light fixture there, Andrea. Is it comfortable, Matt? Of course, and it's easy. It's easy to get up. It's comfortable. Solid surface right here. Just drop down and make a bed. You got cup holders and everything. Nice windows all the way around, Andrea. Um, and it's just a great looking motor home. And it's awesome. Shows and that does drop down and make a bed. I was looking at it thinking, I don't know if it does, but I do see the lift there. There you go. Yeah. Andrea, show us this awesome kitchen. Okay, well, let's start here where the TV is. Matt said there's storage behind here. Wow, look, look at, at all that. that. Wow. That is very nice. I love this countertop. Very pretty solid surface. I look, love it's LED. Lit. Yeah, I love yes. these. And we've got a residential style sink there. Okay. With the extension. Okay. And then over here, I do see an extension just in case you don't have enough. And it's flush. Love that. We got a cabinet under here. Yes, ma'am. We've got one right here. Okay. We've got three drawers. One. Wait, let me Are see. Are they soft? Oh, oh. Soft, soft clothes. clothes. Very above, nice. Got another cabinet. Another one above the. Another one. Convection microwave. Wow, that's a big size too. Yes, two burner induction cooktop, and then three more drawers. Yes. Good size. And then underneath, Andrea, notice how. I love it. No heat ducts in yep. the floor. And the LED lights underneath. Yeah, it's looking really, really good. All right, we got a residential uh, Samsung refrigerator. Perfect. They Freezer. have the locks in place. Oh my gosh. Andrea. That is cold. That like threw cold air on us. It feels amazing. It, it did. That is awesome. And look up here. Yep. From and then your inverter. you have the ice maker and everything. Very nice. Okay, so here is the pantry. Oh wow. Oh yes. Good. You know, Love it didn't it. it didn't look like a big pantry. It didn't. I was like, oh no. But look. Yeah, that's very nice. Yeah, it is. It locks into place. And then here, look at this door going into the split bathroom. This yes. pocket door. It just look, like, looks interesting to me. Like, is there another lock? Okay, so that's why it looks interesting because see how it's on the track. Here? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't, see, we don't see a lot of stuff like that, and I'm having a hard time. I don't know if we're level or not, but I'm not gonna mess with it. It's okay, Andrea. Do you know what time it is? It's, it's now time, time for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Let's see, Andrea. Let's see. MSRP on this motorhome is four hundred ten thousand thirty-two dollars. As the Detroit diesel, Andrea. MSRP. Sale price. 2022, they have it discounted to $329,999, Andrea. And that's for the Dynamax, and I believe Motorhome Specialist is the only place where we sell the Dynamax. So if you guys are interested, contact Motorhome Specialist. Tell them you watch Matt's RV Reviews or go to our website, mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab. We're gonna hook you up with Motorhome Specialist to make sure that they give you a great price, great service, and the best RV buying experience. 
Especially on this American made Dynamax. You know what I'm saying, Andrea? That's right. Here we go now. Let's check out this bathroom. I like the split bath. So what do we got going on here? All right, we got a medicine cabinet right here. Okay. Nice solid surface here in the bathroom as well. Cute sink. Got storage under here. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And then I just, I don't know. I just feel like with the split bath with the sink, it just gives you more room in there. Yes. Oh, what's in here? Talk to me. <gasps> Stackable washer dryer. Stackable. It's splendid. That's very nice. All right, Matt, what's in here? Oh, oh no. Oh, your favorite kind of shower. Go. Wah, wah. Let's see it. Wah, wah, wah. I do like what they did with it oh, on the inside no. though. Oh no. Look, they even put a seat in there. No. Oh, you could totally do that shower. Nope. Yes, you could. Radius? Nope. But it has more room than most radius, I think. <laughs> that's I think like saying nice. you, you know what that's like saying? Oh, he he he's making his classic toilet a no 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 that's like saying like oh well the guy still ran the fastest like but you still finished him it's like that's like saying oh but he still he broke a world record and it's like yeah but if you're still in last place you're in last place and everybody else broke the world record faster than what you broke the world record you know first and first last last andre what i'm trying to say i know america, what, say. what i'm trying to say america is a radius shower and it is unacceptable and look they got more room right here they could have definitely uh did something else like they could have extended it i don't know up here we got more storage and oh we got one of these um electric toilets is that what that is andre i think i'm about to be double disappointed oh well this this is your expertise right here so Mm -hmm. Andrea, look at my foot. Like, I can't even sit and relax. It's porcelain, but Andrea, this is not a prime pooping position. That's disappointing. Wah, 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 wah. You really expected it to be, you know? You know what, Andrea? I was so amped up about this motorhome. Well, it is a good, it is very, very well designed. It is. And to wrap up, how well the design door, it is. coming into the bedroom. Yes, ma'am. Nice king size bed. I like the headboard. Now the bed does not need to be tilted up to get the slide outs in. We got the windows on both sides. Nice headboard. Storage above. Okay. Very nice. And then each nightstand there has a wireless charger and electrical outlet. Not only that, there's USB in the light as well. Very nice. Now, I don't know if there's storage under here. Uh, I don't think so, Matt. No. Let me see. No. Well, what is this? It's probably tanks or something. Oh, but look, this is like a sleep number bed or something. Oh. Interesting. That's a heavy nice. mattress. Okay. We have storage over here. I mean, storage your wardrobe. Storage behind the TV. Sound bar. Other wardrobe. And wow, that's eight drawers all together. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That is very nice. Look at this. Look at the inside of it. How it has that nice wood look. Yes. Very nice looking. Very, very nice. Nice big window here. And Andrea, overall, a great motorhome at a great price point. This America is a super C with that Detroit diesel. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time we give people three things we love about this motorhome. Three things we just don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Oh, this is tough. Let's Likes do or dislikes? three things that we dislike about it. First. First. May I? Go ahead. The bathroom. Okay. WTF. And you guys know what I'm saying. Andrea, just do that again. I went. WTF. I ain't gonna say it, but you know what I mean when I say it. I don't like that bathroom. It literally made me say that, Andrea, I've never once said that in an RV review. <laughs> Those three letters, such small letters with such a big impact. I know. That's dislike number one. Andrea, dislike number two. Oh, it's so, my dislike is so cheesy, you guys. I'm sorry, but I just don't like these. The Lagoon? I, I don't like these. It's just take them off altogether. It just makes it look so cheap. And this is so like, Luxurious, you know, and top of the line. I just, uh, I concur. They're just an eyesore. Andrea, that's number two. I have number third. Okay, what's the number third? Bunk over the cab. Very small, very small. You know what I'm saying? 
Um, it's for a little kid, not even an adult. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and not only that, it's like, I mean, yeah. because of the yep. cab, you don't have very much height. Like, it's hard to even sit up in there. It is what and it super is, Andrea. These aren't normally like that. Well, Andrea, that's three things we don't like about it. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. Would you like to go? I will go Excuse first. Excuse me. Okay, I love the kitchen. Yes. Great job on the kitchen. Excellent counter space. Excellent storage. Just overall, very pretty. That's number one. Number two. Andrea, number two. <laughs> Number two. You know what I'm gonna say? I'm gonna say the bedroom. Nice king size bed. I like how the bed doesn't need to fold up to come in. Right. And you Tons can still, of storage. Yeah. Nice cabinetry, stackable washer dryer. That's number two. And then Andrea, follow me. Oh, you're making me go out there. I won't make you go out there. Andrea, Thank number you. three. I like the blackout package. Yeah. I love this freight the liner grill, chassis. Everything. I love the 7.7 .7 liter Detroit. And I love that air horn. Andrea, this is a badass Super C. That's awesome, tows 20,000 pounds. And if you're driving down the road, people better get out of your way. You know what I'm saying? This is an awesome motor. This is the, this is the uh, RV that truckers are looking at like, wow, that's nice. Sure is. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in this motorhome, please go to mattsrvreviews.com. Fill out the contact tab. We're here to make sure that you guys get a great price, great service, and the best RV buying experience in the entire RV industry. Andrea, what do you want to say? Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Cinemax, they do read the comments and they do watch a video, so please leave your feedback. And make sure and you guys join us this weekend. Yes, don't forget to join us this weekend for our Matt's RV Reviews European Edition. Yes. Uh, we will be over there just looking at really cool RVs. Every Saturday. Yes, and we will Sunday, be there. right? No, not every Saturday oh, and okay, Sunday. just Saturday. So like, if it's Saturday this week, then it's Sunday next week. And if okay. it's Sunday next week, then it's Saturday this week. You know what I'm saying? Guys, we're, we're gonna have We're taking you with us, you guys. We're bringing you along on the European journey. So we can't wait for you guys to join us. Guys, thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll, we'll see you next time. time.